Tommy, you must be delighted to get the, the win here tonight. Yeah, delighted for the, the lads. I think it showed a lot of character after the eventful game we had on Saturday. And it's always nice to win away from home, and, and we haven't done it often enough this season. That's been well documented. But I think tonight, uh, you know, we fully deserved it. I thought we played ex- extremely well up until, you know, getting the goal. Maybe before half time, uh, you know, got to give a party credit. They get back in the game a little bit. I think the second half was pretty even, except. Maybe the last 10 minutes, obviously, they're pressing forward for the goal and we've had to make a few blocks. But, uh, you know, other than the, the, the first uh, uh, save in the first half from uh, Stephen Banks, uh, you know, I don't think they had too many direct shots on goal. Um, after the, the way things ended on Saturday, were we more determined to win tonight? Yeah, I think we, I think we were uh, because, you know, we did feel that... Uh, you know, it was a bit of an injustice for you know for us on Saturday, but uh, you know the important thing was to come here and put a performance in and get the three points, and I think they, they you know they they certainly did that. Yeah, I thought first half we were excellent. Uh, we created some good chances, scored a really good goal. I thought uh, D done exceptionally well for the goal, and uh, Major does what he does. He, he stuck it away for us, and uh, yeah, I thought we looked really comfortable. Second half, I thought uh, they came on to us a bit, but we uh, we defended well, and I think uh, it was quite comfortable in the end. Uh, were we more determined following the result from Saturday to get a win tonight? Yeah, definitely. I think it was important uh, after Saturday losing the late goal. I think uh, it was important here that we came and uh, it was potentially a banana skin as well with him not winning at home all season. So I think we went, went about our business good and uh, I thought we, the lads performed excellent. Uh, Lee Croft obviously must have been disappointed to go off so early on, on Saturday. What did you make of his performance tonight? Excellent. Uh, I think he showed, particularly in the first half, the qualities he's got. You know, he gets past people and he, he can put in a great cross. So really pleased with him tonight. I'm pleased with everybody because everybody, you know, to win you know, a game in this league, you, everybody's got to perform and we did that. Uh, Stevie May, another goal tonight. Um, how hard is it going to be to hold on to him through the, the window? Well, I mean, the, the chairman will make that decision. Uh, but, you know, until his valuations met, you know, uh, you know, Steve will remain our player. Um, you know, I have said, and I, you know, I'm repeating myself. You know, Stevie's told us that he he doesn't want to leave this season. Uh, he wants to stay, and 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 he wants to, you know, make a difference in St. Johnson this season. So hopefully that will remain the case. I think the the thing is, I think he's got a bit of everything. Uh, obviously, he's scoring scoring goals, but I think you can see his play getting better as well, and uh, his link ups, his link ups getting better each week, and. Uh, Listen, he, I think he's, he talks for his cell, he's, he's scoring goals and uh, he's on fire and hopefully it continues and hopefully it continues at us. Um, after the, kind of the, the back-to-back away defeats to, to Motherwell and Ross County, how pleasing is it to get seven points from the last three games? Excellent. I couldn't, uh, you know, I, well I could ask for more, I could ask for nine out of nine and we probably would have got it, uh, you know, if we would have kept everybody on the pitch on Saturday. So really pleased, I'm pleased with the performances as well, you know, they weren't, uh, you know, they were well deserved winning good team performances, so really, you know, pleased with that. And we've got to take that on to the next game and the Dundee United. Uh, yourself, when, when do you think you're going to be back in the team? Uh, listen, just tracking myself as fit as possible, Fergal's doing a good job with me, so uh, I'm looking, hopefully targeting uh, the beginning of March. Uh, to get back, so uh, fingers crossed I'll be back then. Obviously, watching from the sides isn't good, but uh, like I say, I'm working hard with the physios and uh, just want to get back as quick as I can now. Uh, just this last one, how's, how's Tommy Campbell, the kit man, doing? Uh, Tommy, I was speaking to him, I, I, he's back in hospital, uh, speaking to his wife. Um, uh, I got a message from his wife today. Couldn't get speaking to Tommy because obviously he, he's gone back in. I, th- I don't think it's uh, anything to be too alarmed about, but uh, just a wee bit concerned that uh, maybe he, he hasn't made the progress that they thought he would. So I think they're just taking him in for observation now.